A watchdog group this morning is trying to shake up your perception of soda with a provocative new ad. One that turns a famously sweet message from Coca-Cola sour. Vladimir Dutier of our digital network CBSN is here with the grim new take on a classic campaign. Vlad, good morning. Good morning. The commercial we're talking about, of course, is the Coca-Cola Hilltop ad. You could probably sing it right now about teaching the world to sing in perfect harmony. But that commercial is anything but harmonious for one health advocacy group, and they've made a rebuttal remake that's already been viewed almost 50,000 times on YouTube. This 1971 commercial had America feeling good about itself. I like to teach the world to sing, sing with me. And the product it was trying to sell. I like to buy the world Coke and keep it company. The ad is so iconic, it was even featured prominently and positively in the series finale of Mad Men. I'd like to buy the world a home and furnish it with love. Coca-Cola's Hilltop ad, I want to buy the world a Coke, might be the single most famous commercial ever produced. And we wanted to use a little bit of media jujitsu and turn it around. I'd like to buy the world a drink that doesn't cause disease. A nonprofit health advocacy group, the Center for Science and the Public Interest, says it recruited people suffering from diseases related to soda consumption. Working with advertising and medical professionals, they remade Coke's ad, calling it Change the Tune. If not for drinking soda, my, it's just so sugary. My liver might not be enlarged. Might have a few more tea. That's so obesity. Coca-Cola declined our request for comment, but the American Beverage Association, which represents the soda industry, issued a statement to CBS News. Beverage companies are doing their part to make sure consumers have the information they need to make the choices that are right for them. We've put clear calorie information on all of our cans, bottles, and packs. These are meaningful efforts that will have real and lasting impact. Still, the people behind the commercial remake would like to teach the world to sing a new song. The industry is spending billions of dollars to encourage people to drink more, and the health side of the equation needs to get the message out to drink less. This is The soda industry has been on the defensive lately. Berkeley, California voted in a soda tax in November, and many cities and states have been trying to do the same. Not to mention the fight in New York to ban the sale of large sugary drinks. Now this video, which has been coupled with a hashtag campaign, changed the tune. Charlie? Glad, thanks.